Okay, so welcome back to badshot.net um, permaculture and this is my hose lock AC Pro um, water timer. Just to quickly cover a few things, that pipe comes out of, well that's my bathroom back there, oh behind that is my bathroom, so that pipe um, is attached to a push fit T-joint which I cut into the cold pipe which feeds the bath. So that's coming through there and I've just got this to lock off like a um, ball valve to switch water off completely which then goes into my hose lock which is set on a timer uh, currently at four times a day and then this is the rain sensor that comes with it. As for a review, it's worked fantastically. It's not let me down. I've been away for three weeks while well, this has been here and it's chugged away nicely. The only thing is the rain sensor, even though I've set it at its lightest setting, um, which I think is five mil rain, um, unless it's quite a mid to, mid to heavy rain, it doesn't actually switch the watering off. But, um, if it is a mid to uh, heavy rain, it will switch it off and it will just say watering paused. If I just put that on right now, I'll give you some. That's all the programs and that's all there. And you can switch on like 10 minutes or an hour of manual if you wanted to use it. Um, right, so then that pipe, I've drilled a hole through my garden door frame. That comes out. Which is then fed from there, down here. And here we have just like a hole splitter. Okay, so this I can't remember the brand or whatever, but um, as a review, it's fantastic. I'll probably put a link in it somewhere. It just splits it into four, and each of these are like on and off. Um, the cable here, if we run along all the way here, it's attached to the rain sensor. Oh, and as you can see, you can adjust the um, settings for rain so if it rains heavily basically watering stops fantastic and well part of water harvesting and irrigation a little bit of roof goes into my water butt but that's um, I think it's what's that brand the brand is I can't remember the brand but it's a fantastic slim water butt and it's probably packed because we've had heavy rain. Um, as for the irrigation, two of those pipes, one goes into my bed on the left, the other one goes on the right, you can't see it, it's basically weeper holes. Maybe I can get close enough. There it is buried pretty much um, and it's weeper holes all the way through. All that bed and this bed. And as you can see it's doing fantastic we're in july right now early july and i've got a little mini forest well more like a jungle um thanks for watching